All right, so I'm going to take a moment to show you how easy your life can be if you decide to handle all the tedious stuff in Blender, Blender's rigging with Python code. So right here, it looks like I have four bones, but I actually have 16 bones, so it's four layers, and each position has four bones. I'll show you right here, and right here, and right here. Now, I want to set it up so only the deform layer has this check mark, the, the de deformation check mark all the rest I want to turn off but I don't want to go through each step just go target uncheck bicep inverse uncheck bicep user bone uncheck you know what I mean so I'm just gonna go over here I'm gonna hit shift f4 which is the same thing as going over to the Python console holding control I'm gonna scroll up and I'm just gonna show you what happens if I type in bpy.context.object.data.edit bones this is for edit mode and I just get a kind of a reference to the armature data. And I'm going to go like this. I'm going to make a, since this edit bones is a list, I'll even show you here. Let's just do this for bone in this right here, bone. But the weird thing is you get just a list of kind of no data or no, no good information. So I'm going to do bone.name. So now I've just listed out every single bone and their name bone name under edit bones. You can see I have four user bones, four deform bones, four target bones, four, four inverse. And then instead, so let's see, I can go for bone in this whole kind of crazy long name for this list. I'm gonna do uh, if bone.use deform is, uh, what did I do, turn it off, false. I turn it off, so basically any bone that has this turned off, go bone.name. And it gives us the name of the bo first three bones that I turned off, the deformation turned off. So to make my life super easy, since I've already set up everything uh, to have a everything that I want to have uh, the deform check mark on, I've already labeled as a deform bone right here, hand deform and then elbow deform. So I'm just gonna simply go, I'm just hitting the up arrow for bone in this long reference if deform in bone.name bone.use deform is equal to uh, oh I did it wrong let me see here I'll, I'll try this again let's pass let's try it one more time for bone if deform not in bone.name bone.use deform is equal to false and now I can go ahead and look for instance the target bone has the deform turned off the deform bone has it still on this has it off so I can even go I can mimic this what we did before just to list all the bones something similar like for bone and BPY context etc if bone dot use deform is true so I just want to list all the bones that have the deform check marked bone dot name and just the deformed bone. So there you go.